Hello, this is NeedlePointers.com and today I'd like to show you how to make a t-shirt tote. Okay, the first thing you need to do is to put the t-shirt out on your surface and flatten out all the wrinkles that you might have. The next thing we're going to be doing is we are going to cut off the sleeves. You're going to leave the seam allowance that was uh, under there. It'll help to keep it strong. So I'm going to cut along here. And as you can see, this is where the it was on the, the seam. The next thing you have to do is decide how you're going to make the top of your um, bag. Uh, some people use a plate or a bowl and they'll go around it, but since mine has this, I think I'm going to do a, like a little more of a square around there. Okay, so I'm going to just measure I'm going to use a pencil to mark it or a pen to show where I'm going to be cutting. And over here. straight across like this. That's the way I'm going to do mine. I'm, it's going to be like a little square. And I'm going to cut that out. By leaving these in, it won't stretch like some tote bags would. Okay, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to turn it inside out. And we're going to be lining up the bottom and sewing it right along the bottom. All right, we're going to sew. Right along there, matching the bottom. Uh, some people pin it. I don't find that it's necessary. Okay, it's a good idea to sew it again just to reinforce it because. It gets a lot of, um, when you put groceries or you put stuff in the bag, it's, it might break open. So let's reinforce it. Okay. Now, I myself like my bags to have a square bottom. So I'm going to show you how to do that. You're going to line up your bottom seam with your side seam. And then since this is a pretty good sized tote, and see how it forms like a triangle? I think I'm going to make it two and a half inches. I'm going to mark a line along here. And you sew it. You sew along that line. Okay, 
I'm going to do that on the other side. As you can see, I finished now the bottom. I have it squared on both sides. Now all we have to do is turn it inside out, or turn it right side out. And there you have your handy dandy uh, t-shirt tote that you can use to go to the grocery store or to put school supplies in or books or whatever you want to do. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please let us know by clicking the like button. Also subscribe to our channel and visit needlepointers.com for more crafting information.